water, water everywhere, but nary a safe drop to drink. In a world of intense use and increasing pollution of our limited fresh water resources, this ancient rhyme may become a modern reality. Let me briefly tell you about several water-related uses and facts relating to the number nine. Ninety percent of the flow of the Trinity River, which is Houston's main source of drinking water, is actually wastewater from the city of Dallas. This wastewater includes many pharmaceutical compounds, such as Tylenol, Oxycontin, and birth control, that pass right through current wastewater treatment systems. Chances are, if you drink a glass of water in Houston, you're drinking somebody else's birth control. <laughs> 99%. Many of these pharmaceutical compounds can be completely removed from water using a technology I'm researching called photocatalysis. A photocatalyst is a material that takes the incoming energy from light, such as these lights or the sun, and converts it into chemical energy that can be used to oxidize and remove these compounds from the water. I've developed a portable photoreactor system that can be taken to any wastewater treatment plant and used to, as a proof of concept to test this technology. Furthermore, what we've learned in this research can also help in the developing world, where 900 million people still lack access to safe drinking water. To put that number in perspective, every 90 seconds, the length of these talks on this timer, five children die in the developing world from water-related diseases that could be prevented using this technology. 